for shipping of fresh water. Two more boxes. Thank you. So I also got uh, another Red Sea 750. We've been selling a lot of Red Seas lately. So that's one Red Sea, a bunch of boxes, just the usual stuff that we need. And uh, getting all those boxes open this is all the fish that we got for you let me show you we got salt water and fresh water some really really cool fresh water fish let me show you some beautiful rams right here now that's a very large placo that's the 091 or 091 l091 placo look at that beautiful those right those right there in the back are some shovel nose uh, catfish. That pleco right there, that's a, that's a red fin pleco. Crebensis, we got Crebensis. They are with the discus. So that's a discus. Small fringe angel. Fiji fox face. We got uh, an Australian Harlequin Tusk. The difference between the Harlequin Tusk from Australia and the regular one is the blue tusks. You see the, their front teeth are blue and they use it to open uh, clams and stuff like that. Gorgeous, gorgeous fish. So that's one of the new arrivals. Small Queen Angel that I made a video we got uh, the orange tail Fiji puffer or blue spotted puffer or Toby Royal Grammas we got a uh, we have one right now in stock the other ones all got sold we also got uh, an amazing, very hard to come by. This is called the mustard tang, so we have one. We also got something that I've been looking for a long time, but it's just so tiny. That's that's a mystery res, the one that is very hard to find, but for the love of Christ, they just sent me this tiny, tiny one. It will grow up to be an amazing fish, amazing colors, but uh, I kind of wanted to get an adult, but it is what it is. We got some uh, beautiful, uh, some arowanas also. That's a strawberry right there. And that's the blue. So it's a regular silver arowana, but they have some uh, Slightly different pigmentation. Gorgeous. We got some large Oscars also. People have been asking for large Oscars. So we have a few. We got these uh, oxalatas also. We got some parrot fish, especially the purple King Kong parrots. We got some koi also. Little quarries. These are the albino coricates, the great uh, uh, bottom cleaners. That's a little piggy, that's a, that's a cichlid also. Tanganyikan cichlid actually. Oh, that's a, that's a compriceps calvus cichlid. Tanganyikan also. Those are the purple King Kongs right there. We also got a few uh, angels. Some uh, guppy action right here. And uh, more cichlids over here. There's a lot of stuff that we got. These are one of my favorites that I have here at the store. Just look at these guys. These are some beautiful white albino cichlids. That's uh, some of the cichlids that we got also. We've also got some uh, really cool goldfish clown knives. Those little guys are um, our striped gars. So we get a big one and we have a few small ones. There's some shovel nose catfish also. 
That's a Trophius cichlid. They're good algae eaters. If you have a cichlid tank, that's a big frontosa. That's a female actually, a blue zyre frontosa. In the saltwater side, we got some starfish. So that's called a double starfish. Some um, that's another double starfish. Right there, that's a, a black knob, black tip starfish. And let me show you guys the volcano starfish, which is this one right here, one of the sides. And this is how it looks from the front. We got a few extra cichlids. Look at that. More blue acaras. Cichlids, got a few extra cichlids. Not new, but we have it for a while. That's a, that's a Zorro catfish. That's, that's how the mouth is. It's gorgeous. What we call it, a rope fish. We have two in stock. So that's a gold epistogramma. Magnasteri pair, so that's a male. And that's a female. Now over here, we also got something very cool. This gorgeous Achilles. They are golden wonder Achilles. So for who likes Achilles, this is gorgeous. Now here is one of the most interesting freshwater fishes. Fishes, look at that. That's called the glass catfish. And the thing about them, they're pretty much transparent. They're almost invisible in the wild. So that's a beautiful adaptation. Now this one right here, that's a Synodontis. That's a Synodontis. Angelicus. Now these ones right here, brand new also. We got them yesterday. They called Sierra Knifefish. But well, look at that. How cool is that? Some uh, gars. Got some baby ones. That's a uh, that's a butterfly fish. These guys stay more on the surface. They are predators. So whatever is on the surface, they will eat it. They also can jump, so you gotta have a cover for these ones. But gorgeous. That pleco right there. One of the coolest plecos around. If you want something to, to eat algae on your tank, those are great at doing that. Those are flying foxes. Just be careful with the plants, because they can eat the plants. That little one right here up front is a yo-yo loach. Gorgeous little things, good uh, cleaners, good bottom cleaners. A little Trophius cichlid, gorgeous little thing. That's a ram, beautiful rams. They are South American cichlids, but you know, it's all been farm raised in a hobby and they have all these special colors. You will never get this color in the wild. Those ones are new also. Those are Pimadella catfish. That right there is an epistogramma. That's a algodon epistogramma. Put that colorful but somebody's looking for something rare and unique. That's one. These are the common uh, Florida plecos. There's a lot of them. They're great at eating algae. Also, the other thing about plecos, they like to eat uh, wood. So we have here these uh, flakes that, uh, not flakes, like wafers that also have uh, wood in them. So they're pretty cool. Now there's, if you're talking about unique, Plecos, there's this one right here. This thing unique for it's for like a collector, but that's called a, a butterfly pleco, the L52. We have one. Thing is they don't move that much. That looks for something unique and rare. We have it. Oh we also got some uh, Chinese hyphen loaches, which are those ones right there. Now oh, that's a very beautiful uh, epistogramma. That's a the epistogramma Akasasi or fire red epistogramma. That's a male, and we also have a female. Which female epistogrammas are not that colorful, but I got the female. Now, this one, this right here, that's a tiger, royal clown knifefish. She's got those bands right there in the back, tail. 